I accidentally deleted the partitions when I upgraded my OS to Windows 10. Is it possible to get my data back? Users may encounter partition loss scenarios when they cannot locate the file they are looking for or fail to find one specific partition in the disk management. Many possible reasons can lead to this partition loss, like when the file system of your drive is corrupted, you accidentally deleted your partition, so your drive turned raw or unallocated. Don't panic, your data is still likely there, it's just that your system can't recognize it in the moment. Before jumping into recovery tools, you can try some basic fixes first. For example, run a few CMD commands to check what's causing the issue. See how you can do this. Type CMD in the search bar and choose Run as Administrator. Type chkdskx colon slash f slash r slash x and hit enter. You need to replace x with the drive letter of the lost partition. But what if the scan finishes and shows no errors? Well, that usually means the partition itself has been deleted and all the data that was on it is gone too. In this case, data recovery software like EaseUs Data Recovery Wizard may help. EaseUs uses advanced algorithms to scan and locate lost partitions, and it claims a recovery success rate of up to 99.7%. Definitely worth a try. To better show off you the real case of partition recovery with this tool, let's start by deleting the partition. Take this partition of G drive as an example. This partition stores two folders like this, and we can now delete it by right-clicking on the partition you want to delete in the disk management. Choose Delete Volume and it will become unallocated. Then it's time for EaseUs Data Recovery Wizard to shine. Download EaseUs Data Recovery Wizard from the official website. I've also included a quick link for you in the description below. Click Open it and you can easily locate your lost partition. Choose it and tap on Search for Lost Data button. When the scanning is over, you can locate the lost partition directly and find your lost files in the new volume. If you're searching for something specific, like a certain photo or an important essay, you can even type in the file name in the search bar. It saves a lot of time. You can preview your files before recovery. Just double click the desired files and tap on the Recover button to restore your files to a safer place. But what if the file seems broken during the preview? No worries. EaseUs also has a file repair feature. If a photo, video, or document appears corrupted, you can still recover them to get them fixed. See, you can find the two former folders here and another two folders that you deleted even before. Now that you have successfully got your files back, you can allocate a new partition in disk management and move your recovered files there. Open disk management by holding Win and X. Locate and right click on unallocated space in disk management and select New Simple Volume, then specify the partition size and click Next to continue. Set a drive letter, file system NTFS, and other settings for the new partition. Click Finish to complete the new creation of a new partition. Now you can drop your files there. See, is this new partition similar to the former one? If you find this video helpful, do remember to give us a like down below and subscribe to our channel.